So, beside expanding our realm to found the kingdom of Venice. By the way, what is there an empire on this? The empire of Italia. Okay. Ooh, hello, technology points. Okay, so we could go for infantry, which is pretty, pretty strong. And I think we should. We're going to be so ahead of everyone else with this. And also, why haven't we upgraded anything here? Legalism. Religious control mandate. We can revoke from religious subjects. I don't think we get any interesting stuff here we might just as well go with majesty or with noble customs or with popular customs for once city vassal opinion and let's go with tolerance that's fine i feel venice is a if you're running a trade empire you want to be open-minded so the merchant post here was built. Let's upgrade it to Garrison 2 as well. Our income is back up to 30. Okay, we can 100% become stressed to avoid lowering our quality of the work. But I'd rather not be stressed. Stress, I'm afraid of now. Too many people have died of stress. Which reminds me of that episode of the IT crowd about stress. Who are you and why do I have you in my dungeon? Just release the girl. Elsewhere. His heir has about the same prestige. Well, these guys have converted now. Yeah, let's dispatch some maids. Oh, I almost said mages, but I mean, how cool would that be? Dispatch the mages for our pregnant wife. Oh, now we have gotten something. Might be just the flu. Our court physician is not doing all that well. So let us replace him with someone who is a little bit more capable. Our dear cousin here. I made the Baron of this thing here. And it was a good choice. He's doing a job very well already. Good. Very good indeed. We have a rash, which isn't great. How much is a city here? A lot. Big treatment for our illness. Oh, Dioniso. Another successful treatment there. And we go this way too. Okay. Our palace is soon done. Ooh. Oh no, we have the great pox. That's not great. I mean, it is great, but it's not great in the way I want it to be great. As long as he knows what he's doing, that's the one you usually want. That gives a good plus two. So what's going down on here? Is there anywhere left to build a trade post in this area? No, there isn't. So we'll go by prosperity this time now. Build a trade post down here. Can't afford it, it's very far away, so it costs a lot more than building closer to home. 80. How much is this? 268. 
building here, of course, doesn't work. Yeah, we could build it on one of these. So let's build it here. Um, end your plot. Don't don't plot against me, boy. Am I leading troops? I need to stop leading troops. I don't want to lead troops. Leading troops leads to death. Okay. The studies we have conducted in observatory has... We'll follow up on them. I don't want to be craven. We're going to be poor for a little bit, but not very long. It's fine. Just a li little bit poor. This means we're an incompetent ruler right now. That's not good. You don't want to be an incompetent ruler. Lack of funds. Our morale of armies is down for that. I don't know how long this lasts. I hope just a month or two. Doesn't say. There we go. Funds again. He is back to being a worshipper of worship. I feel like the Great Pox is going to take us. Ah, yes, the Necronomicon. We arrive at the abode of a strange old scholar, Ibrahim. After some persuasion, he invites us in. We speak at length and he tells us of a scholar, Abdul the Mad, who knew many things of the strange spheres beyond and talking of beings that are not human. We find out that Abdul the Mad wrote a book called the Necronomicon, in which he recorded many strange and unholy truths. Ibrahim says that he is impressed with our sincerity and desire for knowledge. He can sell us a copy of the book. He tells us to beware, however, as too much intense study of the Necronomicon is said to drive the reader insane. So we could just get the 30 technological points, or we get the Necronomicon as well, which would put us very much in the hole. I think um, we'll go with getting that and being in the hole for a little bit. But now we have the Necronomicon, which decreases our monthly piety by minus two, which we already... Okay, now that's the Necronomicon already doing its thing. Diplomacy minus one, but plus five learning. That's a lot. And as you can and see, we're still lacking funds. I mean, we earn good, so we should be done out of this quick. We have four out of four trade poles, the fourth being built down here, of course. And we might be able to go to war for a city with him again. I still don't really understand how it works, but... Alright. Okay. We have successfully avoided being too penalized for having too little funds for too long. Um, yeah, no. He's too far away. But we'll sign it anyway. It might lead to some discussions and anger and whatnot. Have to see. Of course we become a lunatic. But our wife already is one, I think. So now we're the same, her and I. Very similar. And I feel like the Necronomicon is going to help with that. Let us sign all the non-aggression packs, why not? Give us money. That pirate, he is not giving us. Take a little bit out here. Working in our observatory, we are often disturbed by strange noises, uncannily large insects. I know. We must focus and luckily we did not become stressed of it because great pox still we're going to die early we're not going to get old that's that's pretty certain great post has been built good stuff don't have enough money to upgrade it not yet anyway but it does earn us a little bit Starting out. So 
the trade zones are all pretty much contested. I'm, I'm to take care of Ragusa someday. Looks like the trade post down here is gone again. We could probably go to war and claim the city. Seize the city of Amalfi. Oh, it's not Amalfi, it's Melfi. I'm in Tripsy Block right now. Got a little bit more than us, but we have our retinue, so... Should have enough still. How is our trade post here? We'll upgrade this fully before we move on. Upgrading anything else? The fourth level is important, plus three. Because that puts it up to six, so it can't be sieged down. Alright, the book we bought from the stranger, Desert Scholar, has proven quite useful in gaining new ideas and insights into the study of the stars and what lies beyond. It does, however, contain some quite disturbing texts and images, things that lead towards a level of understanding that might make one mad. Um, and we must definitely delve deeper. Um, we have a chance to become a variety of things. We will be one of them. We are the accursed. But it's okay, because we got 200 technology points. For cultural tech, sadly. Not economy, I think. But it's 200 points that we can put in, like, tolerance or legalism or something. We will eventually get ahead here. I hope. Pass the infrastructure, it's not matter to us at one bit. Oh, look at that! Well, aren't you... Very unfortunately, now in my prison. It's always easier to have them in your prisons. Makes the whole control thing much more feasible. We're almost at enough money to upgrade this here. Hope you are slowly upgrading this somehow. With what little you earn. Ah, okay. Claim on the chiefdom of Krunji. Krunj. Okay, using it would again put us in the hole, but this time by a good hundred. Hmm. Hmm. I am very indis undecided here. No, we don't. We can't afford it right now. Really can't afford it. Let's bring him home. He's done well. Thank you very much. Come back. You did what we asked you to do, but I am too weak, too scared. <laughs> To follow up on such. Um, yeah. Minor decision doesn't really matter. Oh no, we have a new heir. No, 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 that's bad. Our heir died. Doing spy master things. So we'll need to invest here heavily. Make sure this stays fine. Got to kill a bunch. Also, we should probably spy on people. Why am I not doing that? Because I'm not actually on the spy focus, I'm on the scholarship focus. <laughs> but still trying to write our book here. I could switch out the scholarship focus, but... Great wisdom comes to those who study the world and learn from it. Your studies of the stars and other things beyond this world have taken on a very strange path. And we have learned a lot, so... Stars are bright. Oh 
ones a little bit further just to really bring home the point here. Where is he? There he is. The our designated region and our designated heir. Not a state inquisitor, that goes to this guy. And can he be a high judge? No, that goes to this guy. And a commander is also going to be one of these guys. So we have a selection there. Valuable option. No one wants to back. Come on. And a little bit of a gift here and there. And always demand monetary compensation. They might just give it. War Grand Palace was built. We earn 33 gold now. That is fantastic. And that's the maximum amount of upgrading we can do to it. So now we probably just invest into the secret passage until we max that out. And then we take care of all the rest there. Go and collect taxes at home, please. Upgrade this. Probably upgrade this for once. Very good. Okay. We are finally certain, absolutely certain, there are great things we understand, and now we become a mystic, which gives us stewardship and learning, and it's not all that great, but that's okay. We could go for Weird Scholar, which is a little bit less than a mystic, but there, that's the end of it, and now we can switch around, let's go for Business Focus. Let's build this stuff up a little bit. Probably have taken a different focus because we're still writing our book here. Okay, let's approve the plan to kill that man. These are just defensive funds, I think. This is just money we put in there in case something like that happens. And then when we kill the ones that are an issue, we just take the money back out. We have lost a ship at sea, that's bad. Losing money is never good. Not in a merchant republic, most certainly not. You only have daughters, but it doesn't matter either. I think what you really need to do here is have a great appreciation and look out for all the potential heirs you have. Make sure that they turn out well. <laughs> Because you just continually work your way through your dynasty. He's not much younger than us. Let's see how long we reign anyway. It might not be all that long. Can't do anything here because I am stingy and I'm constantly putting money elsewhere. He has lost a bunch of stuff. She has lost a bunch of stuff. You don't have my lot. Let's go seize the city. Do that. Let's get the city of Melfi. Probably not going to work out well for us, but we'll try anyway. Oops. Our levies. Yeah. Immediately land them there. Okay, yeah, he's defending against our landing, which is not a great thing for us, especially since we probably don't have all that many good... Ah, oh, right, we can't... Oh, we can only go where we have a city. I don't think we have a city outside. Do 
do want to stand on my ships now. Yeah, we're probably going to get beaten down here. Mm. Yeah. Someone else is taking over the opportunity to win that battle. If they had arrived just a second earlier, we would have won. But this way we were beaten. This is really bad. This is really bad. Being beaten is bad. Let's get ourselves a lover. Okay, they're probably going to flee somewhere in the same direction as us. We'll just wait for them to arrive here. And fight them then. Ah, they're coming up on us. We'll just stand here and fight them. And maybe make good the 27% we just lost here. Not entirely. <laughs> I am I am not very lucky with trying to get cities outside of Venice. They might be ending their run here. I don't think they are, but they might. Still earning money, that's good and important. Moving troops around. Attack him before he can go. Even though we are in unfavorable positions. And then we go and just siege the city that we want to get. Now we've taken prisoner, which is not important, except for the fact that we can ransom him. Worth 25 gold. Good enough for me, because right now... Ugh, yeah. We lost some, because he, someone was lynched. Who was lynched? I'm just putting people out of our dynasty in good positions, so in case something happens to our designated heirs. Yes, we want to build a workshop. That might turn out as a positive tax modifier once it's done. Might not. We'll have to see. Are they attacking Venice? They're attacking Venice, but they can't siege here, so... That's fine. We have just enough defenders. Um, can't upgrade anything else that's that's going to help it because they might just grow enough people to become an issue let's upgrade this <laughs> why are we doing so badly with these Honestly, this is not going well. Okay, I don't care. Fifty three is what we're looking at to becoming age wise. Okay, now they have enough troops to uh, siege this down. They're going to get stopped on this one. But for now, they can siege us. They are going to take the city. That is a certainty. Very unfortunate. We could hire us some mercenaries, which are going to get immediately slaughtered. Oh good, our defenders did something to decrease the numbers of attackers, so that's sometimes nice. We are building city walls, which hopefully becomes something at some point. Ooh, yes. We're going to debase the mints, so we get 100 gold, 100 prestige, potentially become greedy. I think we already were that. Yeah. Annoyed the religious authorities, and we also owe money. I think it's time to repay the loan. Let's do it. We don't really need the money right now. And I'd rather build it up again. 
have it as a potential rainy day fund or something. All plot is revealed, oh no. Oh, Siege. He's coming along. He's slowly regaining people enough to again siege down. Let's go for siege equipment, which also helps us a little bit with siege defense, I think. Only ever so slightly. Okay, let's hope our defenders do something sensible again. have lost our affair, which is a shame. Come on, defenders, do something. Do something good. Do something daring. Please. Dare to dream. Oh, no. This is not going well. Right, now they're stuck. Um, no, we're not going to sell land. Unless this army keeps growing, which it very well might. It's here. Yeah, they are reinforcing, slowly but surely. We'll have to attack them eventually. That <laughs> Okay, I'll take care of this next time. 